That's the air that goes in and mixes with fuel. All the rest is just going. All the rest is bypass. That's about 75% bypass. Can you tell how my voice doesn't echo in here? That's the acoustic liners going in. So it's just a big prop, right? Um, I, I, I call it an impeller. A propeller works differently. This, the, this system depends on the ducting. It would not work as a prop. If you remove this duct and you remove the duct behind it, the plane wouldn't even move. This doesn't do anything. It doesn't create a really good pressure difference. What it does is it accelerates the air. Propellers actually create a pressure difference because they have a very asymmetrical airfoil. They, they, um, they are spread out anywhere from two blades to five blades or even eight blades on a modern turboprop like the C-130 Hercules that they fly now has eight blades but no more than that this is 48 blades here on a triple seven you have 22 blades so it's a different way of moving air and creating thrust you accelerate the air and get it going just under the speed of sound and what's neat about this is the fan exhaust shields the core exhaust and actually makes the core quieter. So it creates a barrier. And these things take off with all that raw power. And you wonder, how come they're not as noisy as something that only produced 3,000 pounds of thrust? Well, sound is inefficient. If you're making noise, you're wasting fuel. If you're rumbling windows five miles away, that's, that's energy that should propel you, not rumble windows five miles away. So, if you can achieve 